Imagine the beginning of this Quran starts off with all praise is due to Allah. Praise is due to Allah upon good conditions that we know. But what about upon bad conditions? So we're taught still praise Allah. He's in control. Alhamdulillahi ala kulli hal. All praise is due to Allah upon all conditions. And for this reason, on the day of judgment, a caller is going to call out to say, where are those who used to praise Allah upon all conditions? And when they will be called out, they will be told to enter Jannah before everyone else. Subhanallah. So praise Allah. In it, there is a lot of hope. Hope that I'm going to be entering paradise before everyone else because I'm praising Allah. And in it, there is a lot of healing because even in a bad condition, I'm praising Allah. Praise Allah when you're going through difficulty and see what happens. Alhamdulillah. Things could have been worse. I thank Allah. I praise Allah. Why? Because He is Rabbul Alameen. He is the Lord of the worlds. He created me and everything in existence was created solely and only by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. There is no partner with Allah in creation, subhanallah. So this is why when we say alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen, we achieve a lot of comfort. We repeat this in every prayer. Your prayer is not valid without this verse and this surah being recited in it because wallahi there is hope and healing in this specific verse and the surah and the Quran at large.